Hello and welcome to Beanworks University. This is the start of the training lessons. We have broken the training down into short five minute-ish videos with the intention that after you complete a lesson, you log into Beanworks to review and practice the functions explained in the training you just finished watching. By the time you're finished the complete video series, you'll be confidently creating purchase orders, invoices, and payments. But first, let's give you a general overview of Beanworks so that you can begin to get familiar with the software. Beanworks is made of four main modules with workflow tabs within most of them. In this lesson, we'll briefly describe each module, but remember, users have their Beanworks configured to the type of work they do, so most users will not see everything we're showing. Once signed in, we click on the black side navigation bar to expand it to see the four modules and the workflow tabs within them. First is the bean board. This is an information tool for the accounting team so they can get valuable insight about invoices in Beanworks to ensure they are being processed in a timely manner. Next up is the purchase order module. This is where users can create or see imported POs and approve them. This module adds visibility into your committed costs and enables users to easily track spending within their department. Let's move on to the invoice module, the heart of Beanworks. This is where invoices first arrive from vendors or from being scanned. These invoices are coded with all required information needed. Then they are submitted for approval. Once they've been approved, they're exported to the ERP. These invoices now need to be paid, and this is where the next module comes into play. Here you can quickly and easily create virtual credit card, check, EFT, ACH, and wire payments for your unpaid invoices and get those payments authorized. Once approved, payments are released to complete the invoice life cycle. The payment module is also used to create payment backup for payments made out of your ERP and matched to invoices in Beanworks. This is so that the payment authorizers have the invoice backup to review while signing off on payments that are not made through Beanworks. The subsequent Beanworks University training videos will give you a more in-depth overview of each module. Watch them to dive into all the features within each tab of each module. Thank you for taking the time to watch this training video, and congratulations on beginning your journey to becoming a Beanworks master. If you have any questions, please contact Beanworks support by emailing support at beanworks.com.